Julian Davis Buckle towers over me by far. <laughs> Julian Davis Buckle, it's so good to have you here. Now tell Thank me you now, why much. your mother didn't make you walk five <laughs> kilometers to and from school for a year? Thank you very much for this invitation. Well, it was because of poor performance academically. I entered grade eight on probation. I attended Knox. And you had to have a 2.0 G um, average, average to go into the next grade. I had a 1.5. Did I say that loud? Yeah. <laughs> 1.5. <laughs> and my mother was mad because, you know, when I passed my common entrance exam from Christiana Lee's primary, I had to go back to my grade six teacher every evening for penmanship classes and English classes. So my mother, thinking she had done so much, and I was not putting my weight behind her. So she won and can't clap. So that's a punishment for you. How do you deal with it? Um, I cried most mornings, but thank God for a teacher of mine who I will never forget. And as I must say, every teacher's day I call her and say happy teacher's day. Mrs. Judith Case, she was my teacher at Knox. And lucky for me, some mornings I would get right from her. And after netball training in the evening, I'll get a ride back home. So some mornings I was saved. Other <laughs> mornings I, I had to trek the way. So you're walking from where? Sedberg, Sedberg to Christiana? To, no, no, to Spalding. To Spalding, that's where correct. Where my school was. To Spalding, yeah. Where and do you learn your lesson? My, my mother, you hear people talking about barrel pitney. My mother was in America, but I was no barrel pitney. Because I watched with these two eyes, barrels open up in front of me. And my mother had a style of wrapping everything and putting your name on it. So when the bar is open, no confusion, who is for cousin, who is for this, who is for that. And I watched bars open and nothing came from it for Julian. Why? Because I didn't earn it. I didn't earn it. The only thing I benefited from was the food in the barrel. So hang on, <laughs> did you resent that? Um, yes, but not to a high extent. I would quarrel and murmur to my cousins and quarrel with them when I see them put on them pretty dandan. Um, I know it out at the bar when my mother said. It never feel good. But I, I, I had to do what I had to do. And I had a teacher, as I said, Mrs. Case.